with Joan Hunter Ministries. Amen. Welcome back to the NRB 2014, and we are here with Joan Hunter. How are you, darling? I'm doing great. And we're always just squeezing you in somewhere. <laughs> That's right, all over. Even and though we're both from the same area. You know what? We're from the same area. We have to even, I haven't came over and looked at your new building. Tell us about your new building. Oh, it's just awesome. Uh, we got it about a year ago, and it's just amazing. It's I've got my own office after four and a half years without having one, <laughs> and uh, and it's a facility that can hold about a thousand to fifteen hundred wow. attendants. Okay. We're having all kinds of incredible people in, and 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 all, all that we have in, they're always streaming. So we've got great streaming okay. uh, for you know to go around the world, not just there. And we've touched pretty much every nation of the world this year, with the not just in the, all the years, but just with this year. Mm -hmm. So uh, there's a little a little pocket in Africa we haven't hit yet, but other than that, we've had viewers from all over the world. You see, that's that's God because uh, you know with the greater things that we would do, uh, you know, with Jesus said you'd do greater things. I really believe a lot of that's towards the internet as well. Because uh, I totally agree, the, television, yes, and internet, the and communication, auditoriums, and yep. you know the Trimatron TVs and stuff like that for massive meetings. Yes, that's that's awesome. So do you, have you? I know you travel all the time. So yes. where, where did you just come back from? Uh, you had to come back from somewhere. Just got back from Florida. Okay. And the week before, I was in Switzerland. Oh, in Switzerland. And uh, so I, I d trained uh, some students at a Bible college over there. I'm going back uh, in November again. So God just really opened up of Switzerland to me, which oh, is amen. great. So do you have a lot of European ministry that you do? or? Um, well, last year I went to the Bahamas, which obviously isn't European. Um, England, Ireland. Uh, Paris and a few other places like that. And this year, I'm been to Switzerland. I'll go again. Spain. I heard you hit the million Mahler status. I did. <laughs> so I'm a millionaire without the E on it. So, oh wow. <laughs> so anyway, that sounds kind of exciting. I'm believe I'm receiving it prophetically. Amen. Amen. But uh, anyway, but I'm I'm just going all over the world and you know and and hit a million miles on on one airline and did about 140 thousand last year. Last year was a big year. It was a very very big year. Mm, now do you see this last. I mean, I've been noticing this in my ministry as well, but do you see the last couple of years, just there's like a stronger push yes. in the anointing that it's, it's, it's possessing the it's, lands. Yes, it's a Tell stronger anointing and doors. Um, just even as I've been walking around uh, NRB today, it's like, you know, God, I just really would love to get on this program or that nation yeah. network or whatever. And, you know, and it's like people, they're walking up to me saying, when can you be on? And this is the year of doors, and, and prophetically, God gave me the word in December, and released in December, January for this year, that there's going to be doors open, but not just doors, it's going to be double doors. And the doors that have opened today have been way more than double doors that have just been really trying to get on for probably 15, 20 years. Wow. Yeah, so it's been, I've had a great day today oh. at NRB. <laughs> Hallelujah. Amen. <laughs> Amen. So tell us about your new book. Miracle Maintenance, amazing book. It teaches you how to raise your level of expectancy in the area of receiving your healing, but also keeping your healing. Mm. For example, you get healed of stomach problems and different things and ulcers, and it's like, praise God, that there's no pain, there's no nothing. And then you go and you start picking up the stress and you start worrying and worrying, and then you've got acid reflux again and different things. And it's like, how do you get rid of stress? Keeping your spouse, keeping your children, but getting rid of the stress. <laughs> and, uh, you know, and, it, <laughs> so and a lot of you are looking at Joan like, okay, I really want to know this. <laughs> yes, yes. But, um, you know, this is an excellent, excellent book about really raising your level of expectancy in the area of your own healing mm. and uh, and then not only that you get your level raised and then it also raises your level when you pray for people and your family members also you know what that that's an amazing topic because you know we both go work in the healing ministry and we see people healed and then a few months later they're just dragging themselves and they got they feel like seem like it came back on them tell, tell us some a few reasons why people lose well, I, I praise God have very few that that happens to, but in the event that it does, I hear it happens a lot, is that once again, is that, you know, they've got diseases that are brought on because of stress. And then it's like, okay, I'm free, I'm free. <laughs> and then all of a sudden it's like, oh man, Johnny's doing this, my spouse is doing this and this. And, this. and it's like, I got to worry, 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 worry. And then my grandkids are this. And you can worry, 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 or you can just give it to God. And this is a, a tremendous book that will help you in that. It will ha also help you raise your level of expectancy and more than anything else, determination. Mm. You know, are you walking in all that God has for you? All the anointing, uh, all the power, all the health, all the finances. And we need to have a determination like the woman with the issue of blood. 
mm. and just to go after Jesus and touch them of his garment. And when she was made every whit whole, it wasn't just that she stopped bleeding. She got a Holy Ghost blood transfusion. She got healed of chronic fatigue syndrome, low iron, you name it. She got totally healed of all of that, mm. which is great. Amen. Now, Joan, you have a, a different type of healing ministry as far as that you, you could see God shows you different things on the healing. Explain, yes. to, explain to those that, that may not know of your, your ministry. And, and first of all, tell them who your, fam who your parents were. <laughs> My parents were Charles and Francis Hunter, also known as the Happy Hunters. And it's been a lot of, it's been amazing on the floor here of how many people have been healed in mom and dad services. Amen. And it's just been, it's been really, nearly neat, you know, and people that I've met when I was on the floor with my mom and dad previous years. And, uh, but I deal with, um, you know, number one, there's obviously the physical healing, but I teach on what is the root cause of sickness. Too many Christians nowadays are magnets to sickness. And I was recently in Moscow. And so, uh, the, right, the last service I did over there was to the Golden Agers, which had to be 55 or older. So I thought, great, I found, found a place where I fit because <laughs> I hit 60 last year. And, uh, and so I said, how many of you are planning on getting a cold this, this winter? A very logical question. 800 out of 800 raised their hands. Okay. And I said, stop it. I said, your level of expectancy is for you to get a cold. Stop that. We've got to stop expecting, <coughs> you know, that, yeah, oh, I'm going to yeah. get it next. You know, and then we start confessing it. We need to clean our mouths out with Holy Ghost soap and start confessing that I'm by his stripes, I'm healed. And by his stripes, I live in divine health. Mm. You know, and then unforgiveness can be a real problem. Yes. You know, it's like, oh, man, you know what he did to me? That's just eating at me. Well, then you wonder why you have arthritis. It's eating at you. And it's the different things. And I teach on how to get free of all these things. You know, and it's like, well, you've obviously been through nothing. You know, you were born with a silver spoon in your mouth. No, I was born with a wood spoon and had a whole lot of splinters. Mm. But, you know, and God healed, has healed my, the, all the splinters and stuff. And, <laughs> and being deserted by a father, married for 26 years. Uh, my now ex-husband was homosexual. We were in the ministry together, traveling, etc. And it was like devastation beyond words, diagnosed with breast cancer two days after the divorce. But you know what the word says, yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death. It doesn't say I go into the valley of the shadow of death and make camp. And unfortunately, too many people do that. And they allow the sicknesses, the betrayal, the, the, you know, the trauma, the stress, and worry and worry, worry, worry to just fester. And it, mm. be, and it gets a whole lot worse. Mm, that's amazing. So tell, tell everybody where they can get this book. JoanHunter.org. They said, make it nice and simple, 10 letters or less. So there you go, <laughs> joanhunter.org. Tell us about some re some things coming up for you this year as far as ministry. Oh, goes. wow. Going going to Spain, um, going to Canada several times, going to go to Hawaii, well, that working must, that on going to the Bahamas, <laughs> and, um, and then uh, Ukraine. So I'm okay. really praying for the all the riots to stop before I go in a couple of months Okay. and planning on going back oh, to yeah. Moscow. Yeah. And, I had healing services last time. When I go to Moscow, this time I'm going to do um, healing seminar training. Okay, okay. Then, so you're carrying on the tradition of mom and dad there. Yes, and because... the, but I deal with what the root causes too, not just the physical. Okay. And then uh, then we, I just did a healing school in Switzerland. And I'm going to go back and do a school on the prophetic. Wow. Teaching how simple it is to pray for the sick, how simple it is to just hear from God and give a prophetic And how word. hungry are they to learn? Switzerland, that was my first time. Uh, this month okay. it was amazing okay they were like hanging on to me like don't go don't go you know, <laughs> you know like, well we have awesome. to be the service has to be over they're going no <laughs> you know well, and you, they were doing everything they could do just to keep the services going you know john osteen my pastor growing up he used to say tell us as ministers go where you're received that way you that's know right. you're in the will of god and mm -hmm. obviously they're receiving you and they're receiving the ministry that you're doing yes and, and that's that's a blessing that tells you that's where so god's many wills. healings it was amazing mm, that's amazing They'd never seen that many healed in like their entire Christ Christian life wow. in one service, and I had like five services there. Oh wow! They were just totally blown away. Yeah, you know, I, I think a couple of our friends went to Europe and they had some meetings in Germany and stuff. And I just see that that God is going to show that He yeah. is God, mm -hmm. and He's and because Europeans, you, the where it's at in the world, and the the world pretty much goes the way the Europeans go, and and the thinking. You know, God wants to show that, hey, no, he is still God. You, right. can't, you can't analytically think he is not there. You can try, but God is God. Right. Now, I'm going back to Haiti. Wow. It'll be my fifth time in okay. Haiti. 
and the uh, orphanage is pretty much done, the church is pretty much done, and, and we've given out just thousands and thousands of Haitian mm. Creole Bibles. And, Awesome. You know, so we're helping build the church in Moscow. And as soon as it's built, then they can schedule me back in. All right. Well, give me your website one more time before we close. JoanHunter.org. J-O-A-N-H-U-N-T-E-R.org. It goes so quick. Thank you so much. God bless God you. God bless you too, my Thank sister. You. And we'll be back with other great guests.